It just feels terrible. Um, just couldn't get things going on offense. Uh, we had ample opportunities to capitalize, and we just didn't get it done. Um, it was just a horrible feeling. Man. Horrible. Having nobody played well, the offensive line allowed 11 sacks. How much responsibility do you guys take for where the offense is? I mean, we take responsibility for those 11 sacks. I mean, we just have to play better. Uh, there's no excuse for it. But uh, we come in to work every day. We work hard. We put our best foot forward. And uh, right now, we just, we're just not playing our best ball. And uh, I'm confident in this group, and I'm confident that we're going to turn it around. But right now, we got to you know, get to the drawing board and figure it out. It's extremely hard, man. I mean, as an offensive lineman, you know, you want to protect your quarterback and keep him upright. And uh, we haven't been doing a great job of doing that. So obviously it sucks, especially being a competitor at this level. Of course it sucks, you know what I'm saying? Um, you got to play better ball. I mean, there's no excuse for how we've been performing. We're a better group of men. And, um, we're a lot better than what we've been, you know, showing. I can't wait till AT gets back. Um, I mean, having him, you know, definitely, obviously, you know, give us a major boost. But, I mean, whenever he's ready, he's going to be back. But until then, you know, hey, who we have is who we have. Um, I have extreme confidence in Joshua Zulu. Um, he's an extreme competitor. He works his ass off. And um, until AT gets back, I'm confident in this. I'm confident. In Flipping the page, moving on to the next week. Uh, it's just the nature of this business. We're on to Miami. And as horrible as this feels, we got to get up and go to work in the morning. And uh, we got to be there for each other. Um, we all we got, and that's all we need.